Okay, I think we're good. As always, let me set up my little thing over here on the side. Artie's going wherever he wants. And... Okay. I have to remember how to play this game after... Geez, I've been playing Sekiro, I've been obviously Spyro inside. Okay, so the reason that I'm here, and actually now I can uh, take that off, the reason that I'm here is because I needed to have somebody from Pumperum drop me this uh, Armor of Thorns. So I did have to go through like Gundir and everything first. So I wasn't able to, you know, do any of that on stream. I'm also looking for Artie while I'm talking. Oh, there he is. So anyway, um, I had to go through Gundir, I had to go through like this first, just like from right up there is where you spawn in from Highwall, so I could summon somebody here. So this is where we're starting. I chose the life ring as my, my opening gift. I contemplated doing the great soul, but today's goal, we're going to try to get up to 10 intelligence, which as you see, we have eight, um, because we need that 10 intelligence to get Orbeck to come back to Firelink, which is all part of this grand scheme to be able to use things like, uh, what's it called? Power Within. So let's, let's, uh, how do I lock onto things? There we go. Let's see how well this works, eh? Well, that wasn't so bad. Oh, hi, buddy. You're the bad kind. There is, boy, a bit more of a delay than I thought there would be between when your damage is counting. But at least for right now, this isn't so bad. As far as... As far as damage. It's not gonna stay that way. But I do definitely want these souls. And actually, I know it's sort of a cop-out, but I'm going to go back and see how many souls it takes to level up. Because we already have like 3,000. That's from Gundir. And I, I haven't used that, so... Alrighty, <laughs> he's going to knock his camera over, I think. I have to be careful not to roll into the firekeeper, huh? Okay. I want two more intelligence. Oh, and I can do it too. Fantastic. Well, that was easy. Okay, so now let me think. Artie is all about that camera. I have a little list here of things that I need to accomplish. So we're leveling intelligence to, well, level intelligence to 10 for Orbeck. We need to get Yol and get his sigils, and then we're killing Orbeck for the ashes. And then the next thing doesn't really happen until the catacombs. So until then, I think we want to be aiming for endurance. That doesn't change my, oh man, is it vigor? What changes my... Ooh. We need to get equip load higher so that we can be doing better rolls. So unfortunately that's what it's going to have to be for right now. Well, 
this death counter is not going to stay at zero for very long. I can tell you right now, though, that I'm skipping tree balls. We'll come back later if we decide that we want to do all bosses, but for right now, tree ball seems like a nightmare with this setup. Like, let me come back when I have power within and the Morian blade and stuff. I'm not going to be able to spam roll. Whoops, that's what that button does in this game. I'm not going to be able to spam roll for very much longer. I'm going to have to be a little more strategic about that. Okay. Vort is, is where, we're, where we're headed. But see, I use that Estus Flask because I'm so used to playing Sekiro now, and that's like the pick up loot button. Just want me some souls. That's just Pine Resin, if I remember. It does me absolutely no good to go like under the dragon where the treasure chest is because that's a weapon that's like a dark imbued axe or something and obviously we can't use that so you guys hey mr dragon hey buddy where are you there you are help me out here oh it didn't get these guys Oh yeah, well now it gets these guys. Whatever, I'm through, so. Hey Elzeri! Yeah, I've just started, I think these guys are following me. Or they don't care, sure. I've just started, oh god. <laughs> I forgot he was here. This is new game, just regular new game. Okay, okay, okay. We need to not be here. I'll come and deal with this Black Knight. I promise I will, but not right now, because there's a bonfire up here. Oh, it won't let me. Oh, we are in trouble. Okay, first of all, get out of my life. Second of all, please go away. Okay, I don't really think he has very much of an idea of what he's doing. I just want this bonfire so that I can go fight that Black Knight guy, like, for realsies. Also, where's Artie? He's gone. Straight up gone. Wow, you already had the chance for a 1638? It seems like you're making really good progress, though, Elzeri. Buddy, buddy, please go away. You are preventing me from getting this bonfire, you douchebag. This is like one of the first enemies in the game, and he is just destroying my face. That's why it's a challenge run, right? But he's a black knight, so he should be gone like for good once we get him, right? Honestly, the armor of thorns is doing more damage than I thought it would. My 
Estus sucks though. You're easy, bro. Guess where the run died? I'm gonna say that last mission, huh? I'll rest, that's fine. Actually, I'll rest and I'm gonna go spend these souls. They were hard earned. You know, I was gonna say 12. Of course, did the same thing happen as before? What's my equip load? 38. Eh, we're getting there. That's oh, gonna take forever. Okay, where do I want to be? I need to get to Vort. Man, that run to Vort is going to be a nightmare. I could go trigger the dancer if I wanted, but good lord. I'd like to actually make some progress today instead of just getting walled on the dancer for the next three hours. That's too bad. But at least you know what happened, right? So that'll help it maybe not happen again. Oh, he's still here! Oh, you. Well, good to know that I killed that Black Knight for absolutely nothing. Um. This way leads to Vort, I think. Hi, guys. I don't, I don't need the crystal lizard, because that's for, for weapons, and I'm gonna just go right around this snake man. Whoa. Oh, hi buddy. You're not going to trick me into going further down here, though. I remember what happens. Oh, well, they're already here now. Good. Is it this way? Because there's another giant knight in here. I'm going to drink this. Hey, buddy, come here. Bye. There's a thing. Oh, mister. There's a thing down there, I remember. I might just be willing to go and bonsai in and die for it. I don't remember what it is. It, a key? An Estus shard? Something good. One of them's down on the anvil, and one of them's down the stairs. Dark Souls is out of your style, you mean? Yeah, Nesta shirt. Ouchie. Nope. Nope. Gimme a selkie. Yeah, well, that's for Grey Rat. Do I need anything for Grey Rat? Let me through, let me through. Uh oh. Oh, I'm stuck. Hi, everybody. Nice for you to join me out here. Oh, no, there's a way down. Let me out, let me out. Oh! He's just right here, and there's a dog still. Um, this way's a dead end, isn't it? Sure is. Oh, you're alive too. Why is everybody such a douchebag? 
Okay, okay. I remember there being a shortcut or something. It's this way, isn't it? And there's like this archer. Oh boy, having to do this all from memory. It's been a while. It's this. Gimme. Bye. I specifically didn't play through this game again before I did this so that I didn't really remember exactly where I was going. But this is the shortcut that I was hoping for. Because now... Ah! Oh, but this is for this bonfire. I don't want this bonfire. Oh hey, all y'all are in a, in a place that I didn't think that I was. Well, I'm gonna die. <laughs> yep. Not the worst thing. Problem is, now I have to remember where that shortcut was. Did I even get the bonfire for it? Because this is where I thought that I was, and I wasn't. Or at least I don't think I was. Oh no, it was just right down here. Whew. Oh, but I could go back and even make my Estus shard better. That would be smart. I didn't go get my souls either. And I'm gonna die to Vort 50 times, it doesn't matter. I'm just running straight to Vort. Forget all these guys. This actually isn't even the fastest way to do it. Alright, first boss fight. Like, first real boss fight. With the Armor of Thorns. I don't have the banner from Emma. Hold that thought. Is her name Emma? Am I making that up? Hi! Oof. No, I didn't mean for you to actually come and smack me. That wasn't very nice. This not fast rolling is really uh, challenging my reflexes. I'm not used to being this heavy. Her name is Emma. Thank you. I'm not going to murder you right now because I'll leave Dancer for later. Oh, you son of a... Okay, any of you guys gonna follow me? Not really. Honestly, Vort might actually be easier than these mobs. We'll see. Watch me jinx myself. We might be on Vort for an hour.
I've never fought Vort up close. Because I'm usually a caster, so I'm usually standing away from him and he's already dead by this point. Just the very thought of doing this with, like, a Cyrus makes me want to barf. Oh, I didn't mean to get frostbitten. Well... music is so epic though. I'm just looking around for Artie real quick. I think he's burrowed. I didn't quite see where he went, but I guess we'll keep an eye on his little cave for a while. I am, you know what, I am gonna go back and make my Estus better. Because I feel like maybe I would have survived that if my Estus was a little better. Who gets Estus shards? Andre? Well, I, am Andre. I, had the I love Andre. Nope, not that. Hey! Oh, jeez, I'm so stupid. I didn't even allot my Estus. I've been working with three the whole time and I didn't have to. Alright, well, now we have five Estes, so we're already in a better situation. I think Vort will give us too much trouble. It might take a few more tries, but because obviously he gets really aggressive in his second phase, but no tree balls for now. And then who's next? Even. Oh, I didn't do the elevator. I'm gonna assume we're gonna die again, so I'm sending that back up. non-existent souls. Hi, buddy. Yeah. 
You gonna do something? Okay. I really want to be leveling my stamina, but with my equip load the way it is, I just don't think that I can right now. Where's Havel? Oh geez, Havel's in the Arch Dragon Peak. Is his ring with him? Because if I can wear Havel's ring, I don't need to focus so much on on my equip load for fast rolls. Wow, how did that hit me? Well, it, it continues to, so... What are you doing, dude? Okay. Oh, I thought I could make it through some of it. I guess I didn't realize he takes that huge long pause. Good to know. We're learning. Yeah, I can't dodge into that one at all. Like the timing for dodging when he's sort of got his mace at an angle like that is a bit different than it seems, I think. Because having faster rolls and more iframes would obviously help a lot with this set. Let me see if I can figure out if Havel's ring is with him. I mean, I have the life ring, but in reality, that's not like super helpful because the regen is just so slow. that I timed that right? I did not, it turns out. So this is already bad. Tis what we should expect from an Armor of Thorns run. Let me see about Havel's ring. 
Like, obviously, we do have to get through Vort anyway. But I just want to see if it's with Havel, because then I can prioritize going in that direction first. It is. Havel's ring. Created with the soul of a stray demon. Okay. No problem. That's that's easier than I might have expected. Um What about like the grass crest ring? Is that a thing? That's in Farron, I think. Oh, it's the grass crest shield. I meant Chloranthi ring. Because I can offhand the Grass Crest Shield, right? Sorry, I'm just uh, seeing where these things are. Grass Crest is in some location. The Road of Sacrifices. Okay, and then Chloranthi Ring is in the, wait, what? Oh. Oh, yeah, okay. I, I remember where it is. It's over by Sigward when he's fighting the, when he's fighting the demon. That's not too far from here. Honestly, it's not going to be that hard to get Chloranthi to start. that just count as a plunging attack because I landed on that guy's head with the armor? fair, Vort is actually kind of one of the hardest bosses for me to start with because I know absolutely nothing about like his moveset or anything because like I say I always play as a caster where I stand like right here and so all he ever does is creep toward me and then he's dead as opposed to like Slave Knight Gale I don't think he, honestly, is going to be a problem. Madeira's going to be a huge problem. Because we are going to do the DLC. See, these these rolls, they, I'm rolling later than I should be because I'm expecting faster rolls. Unfortunately, I have to use this time to heal. See, I can't dodge into that, or I can't do it at the time that I'm doing it. It hits me every time. It worked that time. I guess I just have to not be scared of him when he does that. Am I even hitting him? 
Yeah, I mean, I am still hitting him. I, I need to get away. I can be under him and healing a little bit here. Oh, oh no, I'm okay. I'm not gonna be okay for very long. Yeah, I dodged too early. We're making progress. That's the furthest we've had him. So Artie is basically gone. He was here right at the beginning, but uh, I guess he decided to burrow. I can provide Artorias cam. I cannot necessarily provide Artorias. <laughs> oh, you douchebag. Moo-hoo-hoo! Come on, buddy. Let's get this fight started. This was most assuredly how I wanted to start. Wow, it's real hard to not get frostbitten in there. I can't see what's happening anywhere. I knew he was coming. Ugh. That felt good.
It might honestly be worth it to not even go after him at all when he's doing his little ice breath thing. Because I have not done that where he didn't hit me with it, even if I'm standing like behind his butt. Also, that totally counts as a plunging attack if you plunge with the armor of thorns. Does that mean that I can one-shot Ancient Wyvern later? If it counts as a plunging attack? I gotta be careful not to go too close to his ankles. Because he can sort of nick me with the, the outside of his mace and these wide swings. Yeah, see, I did get frostbitten. Okay, so I just can't step into him at all at that point, basically. Is it not to do with the ice attack? Is it more to do with just him in this phase? Like I said, I've never fought Vort this close, especially in his second phase, so... stupid of me. Yeah! Whew! That did not take that long. Six deaths and one of them wasn't even to Vort. Whew! That was fun! Take my 3,000 sweet souls. ring is still far enough away that I do want to put more into our equip load but I'd like to split it I think between oh I don't have enough I only have enough for two I'll split it between vitality and endurance Mr. Vort, now dead.
So we've gotten the 10 intelligence for Orbeck. Once we find him in... He's in, like, Road of Sacrifices, right? On the way to Farron. Uh, he'll come back. Then we can murder him in cold blood. But, wait. No, that's later. I was thinking about where Yol was. He's down here. Because we do need to go find Yol, and we need to, to get his sigils. Because we need to get five sigils from Yol, then when Orbeck comes we need to kill him, get his ashes, and then the five sigils from Yol will make Yuria appear, and once we get the ashes of Orbeck, we can give those to Yuria and she'll give us a sword that will help to boost our Ar Armor of Thorns damage. So in the meantime, if we happen to find the Grass Crest Shield first, I should probably light this, we'll use that in our offhand. Honestly, though, as long as I'm not swinging the blade, I can have the Grass Crest Shield and the blade equipped. As long as my armor is the only thing that's doing damage, you know? Once we get past the uh, Boreal Knight near Tree Balls, uh, I'll use these, these, uh, souls that I'm picking up for some free levels. If I go all the way this way, will the dogs not bother me? Please leave me alone. Please just keep eating your, your carcass or whatever over there. Yeah, yeah, don't mind me. Which one is he? I know you're in here. See you? He's the one that's still moving, but none of them look like they're moving. And I don't want to roll around. I might kill him. There you are. Oh, oh then it's true. The champion of Ash, as I live. In your presence is a great honor. I am Yol of Londor, a pilgrim, as you can see, only. Can, can you not, maybe? Like, creepily stick your head through my body? But perhaps my calling lies elsewhere. Say, Champion of Ash, how does the idea of taking me into your service strike you? I was once a source. Okay, bye. Thanks. I feel like the item that those dogs are guarding are just like black fire bombs. Okay, dogs are not super hard to deal with with the armor. However, I am gonna run out of stamina, if I'm not careful. I mean, there's a bonfire right through the gate, so I'm not super concerned about health stuff, I just don't want to die. go ahead and close this so next time those guys don't come through I'm 
No. See, I'm used to Sekiro. I was looking specifically for the rest option. That's not here. Okay, the Chloranthi ring is over, like, sort of by him. It's over in, like, that tower. Let's see how hard these guys are. Hard enough that I don't probably want to just stand here and do this. Okay, I know that there's guys hanging from the ceiling, and I know that they're gonna drop down on me. There's an Estus shard right in front of her. I might die. That's okay. Where are my bone shards at? Oh, I forgot that I was embered and I haven't died and Hodrick is here. Oh, my bonfire. Can I light it, please? Okay. I mean, I'll give you a shot, Hodrick, but I don't think it's looking too swell for me. Another guy's coming back. And Hodrick is just destroying my face. <laughs> I am not very good at timing those dodges with Hodrick, am I? Hey Vanquish! Nice to see ya. I think I'm not Embered anymore. Therefore, Hodrick won't invade. Like, I think you can control whether he invades or not. I don't need him to. Like, he's connected with that whole covenant thing, but... No big deal. How you been, Vanquish? Did you beat your time yesterday on Refunct? Is that what that game was? Give me my souls. Wait. This isn't the right place, is it? No, that's not the place with the bridge. I was gonna go try to make friends with the giant so he doesn't shoot me here. There's something. Oh, I remember. I remember. It's this thing. How do I jump? Oh dear. Oh, well, that kind of worked. Ow. Buddy, I'm your friend. Please leave me alone. Well, bye. Wow, 20, 20. I can read numbers. 254 is pretty good improvement. Congrats to both of you. Hey, Wolf Ox. Nice to see ya. How you been? Why would I not just go burn this undead bone shard? Oh, my souls are over there now. That was a death. I forgot to update the counter. Doing pretty good today. Thanks. 
my work's done for the day. Uh, we beat Vort, which honestly was a little more than I expected. Let's burn it. Yeah, this one. But yeah, work's done. Um, Vort took me five tries, which honestly was way faster than I expected because I've never fought Vort as anything but a caster. We ended up just sticking with breakfast, but I made sausage, eggs, like scrambled eggs with avocado and cheese in them, toast, hash browns. I forgot the chocolate milk. I bought chocolate milk just to have with that meal, and then I forgot it. So we're gonna have that today with regular tacos. Get out the doorway, get out the doorway. Oh, you guys suck. Oh, you guys suck. Let me through. No tree balls for me. Thank you very much. We are skipping him, at least for right now. Like, I'll run and try him once I get a bonfire that's closer. But I wanted to open this door. Personally, Wolfox, I don't find this game particularly hard, like, if you're just playing through it. The way that I'm doing it, yes, it's very hard. Because this Armor of Thorns does, you know, 15 damage. Oh, guys. Guys, no. No, guys. Guys, let me go. <laughs> let me down, let me down! But if you want a hard game, I heartily recommend not getting stuck in the middle of a cloud of rats. I highly recommend Sekiro. All right, giant rat. Oh, this giant rat has something good though, doesn't he? Go, 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 go. That ghost spooked me. The giant rat has the life ring, I think. You are not worth it, buddy. But I think I can get plunging attack even with the with the armor of thorns. Gotcha. I knew he had a ring. Can Bloodbite help me? Because I need all the help I can get. Sure, I'll take it. Not like I'm wearing anything else. Yeah, Sekiro is like super fun. I just started my second playthrough of it. Um, and I'm, I'm really enjoying it. I think that they did an excellent job. As far as like the mechanics, I was really concerned with... I can go get that giant to stop shooting at me. Um, I was really concerned with when we first saw previews, you know, we were seeing people parrying attacks and I was very concerned about hitboxes and things like that. But those hitboxes are tight. Except for Demon of Hatred, let's be real. Don't hurt my Sigward! Hi, buddy. Oh, I missed you. Please help me with Yorm later. That means I have to do all of Sigward's quest, right? Don't hurt Sigward. I will murder you. 
harder than normal. This isn't where the giant is. Yeah, it is. Hi, please be my friend. I help anytime. I help anytime. I help He's so good. So pure. Alright, that's done. First gold skull on Castle Crashers? Nice. That didn't take very long. <laughs> that wasn't what I meant to do. Bye. I mistook that le that like that texture for an actual ledge. That was not right. It's okay, I need to talk to to uh Sigurd, anyway. Hey, big rat! Why are you still here? I murdered you so that you wouldn't be. Not even gonna make it to Sigurd. This is the beauty of Dark Souls, right? Every time you die, everybody's back. But I'm doing this entirely from memory. I've played through this game, oh good lord, a lot. But it's been a while. Like, we have the platinum for this. Um, but it's been a while, and I'm doing, like, all of these character quests and all of that from memory. I, to be fair, I did look up, like, where the Chloranthi ring is and stuff, just to make sure, but... Commencement rehearsal, Vanquish. Ah! That, I seem to recall, was one of the most miserable days, like, this time of year. Like, it was super boring. If yours is going to be the same as mine was, at least. But, I don't know, I guess it's better than doing other things. He's gone. Sigward. Yeah, but I, I think commencement is just boring, right? Because you just sit there and listen to them talk about things you already understand. No, I guess it was helpful, though. Made me feel less nervous about about the whole process, like later. Well, I hope you enjoy, or at least get something out of it. Oh, can Sigurd die here? I didn't even think about that. Because if Sigurd can die here, if I don't kill this demon fast enough, he's not going to be there for Yorm anyway. I mean, he can die to Yorm, so why wouldn't he... <laughs> Why wouldn't he be able to die here? I could no, I think not. I the Chloranthi ring is over here, so... Alright, buddy. Are you ready? Because I'm gonna need your help for realsies.
Sigurd, you are so much stronger than me. Locking on with the armor thorns is a bad idea, I'm learning. Oh, I'm probably hurting Sigurd too. If I'm rolling into him. What are you doing? Oh. Well, don't don't do that again. Nope. Sigurd, don't die, buddy. We've almost got him. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I'm alive. I'm alive. And he's dead. Yay! <laughs> Whew. Ah, that was quite a performance. But you mustn't get in over your head. We unkindled must put our duties first. But... For a moment, we were toast to me. Do I have? Oh, I don't have. I don't have toast. I wanted to toast you, buddy. Yay! Oh, now I got it. Well, the first thing I'm going to be doing is switching this for toast, because this won't be the last time we see each other. Bye! Well, I'm going to have myself a little nap. The only thing to do, really, after a nice toast. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I can remember where Chloranthe is in here, because that's the whole reason I came over here. In addition to Sigurd, of course. I think maybe I'm thinking of Flynn's ring. Yeah, I don't need that trash. Whatever. Where am I going? This shouldn't be a dead end. It should lead to the witch ladies. Right? Where's my chloranthy ring? Oh, it's right here. The Alright, there's like some dogs, there's this guy. I remember this place really well. Okay, I'm gonna actually kill you guys because you are driving me nuts. Stop. Now you two, I was gonna press uh, L3 for crouch. This isn't Sekiro, even though I've been playing it like it all day. So this is Flynn's ring, right? Not Chloranthe? Yeah, okay. Chloranthe is like down here? Well, those are helpful anyway. Yeah, see you later, Vanquish. Thanks for stopping by. Good luck with your commencement preparations. Now, this is just Lucatiel's set from Dark Souls 2. Well...
I should have just used that Estes and healed. It would have been fine. And now we're all the way back here. At least that demon isn't back, though. You giant rat, why are you a problem? You're not a problem any other time that I play through this game. No, 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 ugh. You suck. My souls. My souls! My souls! <laughs> They're gonna be gone. Giant rat, I shouldn't have to kill you every time. You should die just once and I'm dead. Ugh. I don't even have an arty on an arty cam to make me feel better. He's burrowed. He burrowed a while ago. So, what I'm hoping is to go get this Chlorianthe ring. Am I dumb? Yes. Go get this Chlorianthe ring. Put it on. And benefit from better stamina. Well, better stamina recovery, you know. Ugh. Giant rat. Can you, like, not, though? So we'll go get the ring. And then... I will go and attempt tree balls. He's not gonna die, let's be real. So we're probably gonna skip him, mostly, for now. I'll come back. Oh, this place is a nightmare. I'll come back to Tree Balls later when I have, like, Power Within and the Morian Blade and things like that. Because then the way forward is just underneath this elevator. Uh, hey guys, <laughs> come on, fall down. I dare you. But yeah, so I just want to get the Chloranthe ring, try tree balls, then we'll call it a day. We killed Vort today. I'm happy with that. I accidentally rode this all the way to the top. And then underneath that elevator is like the Boreal Outrider Knight. I guess I'll I'll make my way past him today too. Her, maybe? Not sure. And then that leads to like Crucifixion Woods and stuff, which is on the way to our very first Lord of Cinder, the Abyss Watchers, who is gonna be really hard, I think. But that's why we're doing this, because we want things to be hard. Hi, dog. Where's your, where's your brother? There he is. I did not even notice this chest here. You have Mimic? I don't think so. Really? 713 appraisals for Beware of Ambush. Do you mean up here? Ah, eh, fuck it. Okay. Oh! So there was an ambush. Yeah, I'm basically a total noob. 11 deaths in Dark Souls, like, at all? Worthless. I hear it's pretty easy to get through Dark Souls without ever dying once. There's my Chlorianthe ring. I knew it was here. 
That Mira stuff is from Dark Souls 2. What's Flynn's? Does Flynn's stack with the armor thorns? I'll put it on, I guess. Oh, I can only wear three. Even though I... What? Oh, it's in the same spot. <laughs> I mean, I have ten fingers. Come on. Alright, I got 40 souls. I'll just go and mess around with tree balls. That sounded weird. Like, I can't even reach these, you know? Yeah, I just wanted to pop one. accomplished that we just popped one of his little ball things. I don't know how I'm not getting hit by any of this. That's not how this is supposed to work. have any healing left. Oh, I got him! Well, I mean, obviously not all of him, but... Second phase, baby! Yeah, and that's it for me. That was way further than I expected to get on Curse Rodgers Greatwood. I was gonna come back to him at the end of the game, like after we had beaten Gale. But who all is excited for Madeir, am I right? Although, I really want to do this all by myself, but I do genuinely do not know if I can do Demon of Pain slash Demon Prince by myself. What was I doing? Oh yeah, Boreal Outrider Knight. So we're going to hit the next bonfire in the next area that we're actually trying to progress to. And then we'll be done for the day. Oh, I did want to talk to Egon here. I'll just trigger his dialogue. Hi, buddy. Ah. Good, thanks. <laughs> I don't really know that he's going to help us at any point, but I do feel bad skipping characters entirely. Oh, of course it's going up. I want to believe that I can get this Outrider Knight on the first try. I truly want to believe. 
but I think he's a bit harder than he might appear. In fact, I'm gonna send this back up. We have a chloranthi ring, so we're unstoppable. I don't want an ember. Wow, okay, I need to learn how to dodge this guy. Well, um, the answer was that wasn't it. Good god, he has so much health. I got greedy. He was almost dead. Like, if I hadn't had to use that Estus the first time, on the way to him, we could have gotten him. Or if I would just get good, jeez. Now, you know who I'm not looking forward to is the stupid crucified guys in Farron. Like, in the Road of Sacrifices. Ugh, they're the worst. Like, even when we were on, like, New Game Plus 4 and had 99 intelligence and all the attack power you could ever want, they were still a nightmare. That guy with that mallet, man. Also, I died and I didn't update the counter. I'll fix it in a second. There you go. Roll. <laughs> that was that was good. Dying in record time. There's a little bit of delay from like not like the bad kind, but like the programmed in kind on this guy, and then also I'm still not used to dodging with this much of an equip load. So, I'm a, I'm slow on the draw. Because the, the roll happens slightly after I expect it to, since I've never been at this high of an equip load before. So I need to sort of get over my own mental idea of, of dodging. I thought that was pretty expertly done, Wolfox. I mean... It was, it was a real fast death. I don't know that you're going to be able to beat that. Well, well, this one was even better. I'm going to try something new with these guys. I'm gonna try something else to, to get them out of the way. Because we are just absolutely gonna die if we just stand there and try to, to kill them all. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty on fire today, Wolfox. It's been going really well. Mallet Man!
I'm gonna do something else else. Sure thing, Wolfox. I probably won't be here unless this continues the way that it is. All I want is to kill that icy, like, boreal knight, and then I'm done for the day once he's dead. So I may be gone by the time you get back, but thanks for joining in any case. Yeah, I'm gonna try something new. Again. <laughs> Just to get past them. See you later, Wolf Fox. Alright, now you guys. Dog, you can come this way. That's fine. Hi, dog. That went way better. I'm your teddy's dog. I didn't mean for you to follow me the whole way. Oh, that's going up again. I thought I sent this up when I knew that I was going to die to that boreal guy. Yeah, everybody else, you guys basically missed Artorius. He was here right at the beginning of the stream, and now he's laying underneath that aspen that's on the camera. But he was really, he was all up in the camera right at the very beginning. He left right about the time we killed Vort. I just do not understand how to dodge this guy. That's why they say get good, right? We're still in the getting and not the good. Oh, I should go back and talk to Yoel to get my sigils. I am actually going to go do that. Well, I don't know. I'll kill the Boreal Knight. And then go back and talk to him. Finish off there. Because to be fair, like, I'll get a few levels from Yol, but that's not going to help that much. It's not going to put me into, like, a new weight bracket or anything. Fat lady, move, please. I didn't send the elevator up, I don't think. Expertly done. Bye. I did not expect this burial night to give me a harder time than Vort. I thought maybe being proactive would help.
not bad. Straight sword I can't use. That's cool. Did I just die more times to that guy than I did to Vort? I feel like I either did or it was just the same. Oh, uh, this... I thought there was a bonfire right through here. I've been lied to by myself. I will use these souls, probably the same time that I get those levels from Yol. Where's where's the drop you down bit? This place always confuses me. I really thought it was down here. Oh good. <laughs> survived that somehow. Like, where's Maneater Mildred? I know that she's around here. It's like a drop-off off of a cliff or something. I feel dumb for not remembering. But these guys are just going to murder me in the meantime. I mean, I already checked here, I thought. Yeah, okay. I gotta get to this next bonfire. I'm not stopping until I do. Oh good, now the big rat sees me. That's that's exactly what I want because she comes after you like fucking heat seeking torpedo <laughs> and then that happens. Fuck off. You too, you little rat. Oh, hi. <laughs> nice to see you. Oh, good to see that that hit me anyway. Ah, uh, all that effort. Where is that way forward? <laughs> In the woods. Large rat. Above average size rat. Please let me go. Shetty man, you're on my list. Watch it. Hopefully I don't have to run through here again. If I don't just get so crazily disoriented next time. Up or down? Down. Good. I mean, 
it should have just been a straight shot, right? Am I being dumb? Because I was looking for Maneater Mildred. Not to fight her, but just to see, like, to orient myself. And she's down on a little cliff. There's a bonfire right here, you goddamn idiot. <laughs> I lost those souls for no reason. I thought there was a bonfire here. I didn't lie to myself. I lied to myself about lying to myself. To be fair, that bonfire kind of blends into the grass, doesn't it? Alright y'all, give me some levels. I totally forget where he lives. Down here? Yep. Okay, now let me think here. Oh, that gives me two that time. I really need to get this down though. Havel's ring is not super. The grass crest shield is close. Where was Havel's ring? Sorry, let me look real quick, guys, to see where Havel's ring was because um it's not with Havel in Arch Dragon Peak. Oh it's made from the soul of the stray demon, I remember. So let's do endurance for right now because Havel's ring is gonna help us um with this equip load thing and we shouldn't spend all of our, our skill points on it. Let's see how much it takes to level up. We'll burn up our souls. Sixteen fifty nine, and I have no idea how much these are actually worth. Except for Vort's soul, because, well, I mean, there's really no reason not to eat it, right? I should hit you selected. Yeah, that's going up by two. That's a pretty good return. I have no idea how much any of these are worth, so three. Not equipment. And now it's just four. Okay. I'm gonna go outside real quick. See how much these guys are worth as far as that's not outside. As far as um, getting one more level. This isn't actually a fog gate, it's just the game loading the outside world. Oh, there's the there's the guy with the big sword over here. He's probably worth a lot. Can I beat him? Hmm. Maybe. Might be able to convince him to fall off the cliff. Hi! Plus I can have his help with the uh, gun deer later. Okay, odds, odds of beating him have, have decreased significantly. Yes, yes, yes! Fall off the ledge! Fall off! Okay, well, I'm dead. 
Okay, he was a bad idea for souls. Let's go back and retrieve those souls, at least. I just wanted like 300 more. Anytime now. I've got cute little like claw footsies. He's coming. Oh lord, he coming. He's gonna be right outside, isn't he? Where, where is he? Okay. So he chilled back up there. These guys were the ones that I wanted. That was not very much. Maybe there's just like a little tiny soul blob around here somewhere. I don't want your homeward bones. Bad things happen down here, don't they? Let's find out. I don't want your embers either. Sweet, that was like 10. Hmm. The only reason that I wanted to level up again is because you need to die in order to get Yol to to give you your next little doohicker. But we don't have to worry about it. Because I don't want to forget to do Yol. I don't remember what the triggering condition is for why doesn't he... Oh, you have to die five times, don't you? Well, I'll farm that up off camera so you guys don't have to watch me sit here and die, I guess, 20 times, right? Um, but yeah, we made it past the Boreal Night. We, uh, we killed Vort. I think that we did pretty well today, and it was fun. So that's it for me for today. Um, when I have time on Fridays, we'll be coming back to this run. And maybe Artorius will actually be on camera a little bit more, but he's free to come and go as he pleases, so. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and I'll be back on Monday like normal with Spyro, Tuesday with Inside. Um, so yeah, I'll, I'll be back. And have yourselves a great weekend and a great rest of your day. See you later, guys.